This is hip curves braced against a wall. So find a wall or a doorway, something you can brace one side of your body against. Bring your feet together and have your outside leg as the working leg. Take a deep breath in, pack the air down. Start to push the hip across the midline, pulling it out, making sure you're not pulling away from the wall. This is gonna stop your body from compensating. Now, when you push back again, try and keep the hip anchored to the wall, not pushing back with the leg. Bring that leg back around, internally rotate and complete the full rep. And we go again, breathe in, tension around the body, internally rotate, pull it back as far as you can and in, pushing back with the heel, abducting, taking the leg away from your body, up as high as you can, and back down, that's two, we go again. Three, up as high as you can, around as far as you can, push it right back, knee to knee, back the other way, push back, bring it up and around, keeping that body right against the wall, that's three reps. Let's turn to the other side now. Keep that tension nice and high as you do this, brace yourself against the wall. Really connect that hip and your torso. The foot can be slightly away from the wall. So start that rep, bring it up and around to the front, round to the side. Internally rotate, take it back as far as you can and pushing back, up and over, coming back round to the front. Keep that body nice and still. Use those hands and arms to create that tension. Really ramp it up now. Pushing through this rotation even harder, bigger circle each time, connect knee to knee, push back, up and over, bring it higher again, this is your second rep, connect down, third and final rep, pushing up one more time, best yet, lots of tension, keep breathing through it, back as far as you can, connect knee to knee, push back, bring it up and over, knee connecting to that shoulder, bringing it forward, and down, that is your hip cars against a wall.